Tipsy. Oh, I'm luckier. Today we have an epic video, but first I want to ask you to check out the channel, subscribe for more amazing Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, and please remember to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the content. All right, today is an epic day because we have another massive mystery box from a fan. And if you guys want to send in a epic mystery box to open up on camera, all that you guys need to do is email us at simplysquadsq at gmail.com and one of the Simply Squad members will figure it out how we get that mystery box over here and I still will have no idea what's inside. And uh, today's mystery box is from Garrett, so I'm excited for that. All right, you guys ready? Let's pop it open. Also, we brought out our green Simply Unlucky Playing Out today. Very nice. Uh, also, we have Joey. Joey's going to watch over this uh, video with us today because he said he's a fan. And uh, there's a comment about the cardboard cutouts talking at night amongst each other about the videos. So uh, I heard Joey has some good things to say. So he wanted to watch today. All right, you guys, here we go. Let's see what's inside. Our first view at this mystery box. Let's come in. Let's see. Wow. We got two classic binders, that's gorgeous. That is the Kaiba and the Yugi binder. So do we know where the epic stuff is? Not really? <laughs> okay. So I'll just, uh, oh wow, okay. Some cool stuff inside. We have a Pojo's unofficial Yu-Gi-Oh 2006 trainer's guide. What the heck? All right, we'll look through that, we'll look through that. Then we have some Rubbermaid boxes of cards here, you guys. This is gonna be this is gonna be a big one. We got a deck box. We got more boxes of cards. Oh my god! More cards and more cards. Oh my god! This is a massive amount of cards. All right. So we have some more cards in here as well. This is this is this is great. So, this is what you call a mystery box. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take out some of these piles, we're gonna go through them, kind of a little bit at a time, and just kind of see where we're at. This is great. This is Yu-Gi-Oh. I feel like this duelist hasn't played Yu-Gi-Oh for many, many moons. Oh, hey, 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 Stratos, my boy. I'm gonna set those Stratos just right there. Very nice, we got some heroes. Got some fake cards, Black Cow's Magician is back. And um, got some Blue Eyes cards over there, very nice. Time Wizard, that's uh, he's experienced um, some <laughs> Shadow Realm-like duels. He's definitely taking some, taking some damage. It's great. All right. Next we have some of these legendary collection boxes here. Holy guacamole, man. All right, give us give us a second with these guys. All right, you guys, so we went ahead and made sure all the cards were kind of upright, um, just so that we can go through them for the video a little quicker. And so, I haven't really looked at these two boxes, so I'm excited for that. Um, but yeah, let's check out these commons over here real quick. And so it looks like this was a collector who really, really didn't use sleeves. So it's kind of interesting to see how some people, and I think even uh, our guys here at the Simply Squad, they kind of mentioned that the collector had these cards. It wasn't really about keep, keeping them in high value. They just wanted to play with them. And I mean, if you think about that, you're just gonna spend money, um, not expecting to get any money, oh baby, to get any money in return. Um, and you're just gonna have fun with it like a board game. You know, it's pretty cool. Oh, strong, yeah. Terraforming. Um, and you know, that's, a, that's an okay type of thinking. So that's, that's all right. But then it's hard to get some value back for that. That's the kind of, cause like what you'll see, most of these cards are pretty, pretty damaged, but it does look like somebody, somebody had lots of fun with these cards, man. Classic cards here. Looks like a ton of structure deck type cards. We got a whole bunch of snatch steals going on here, guys. Look at that cold wave first edition from the star deck. Nice. Sojin. Some lightning vortexes. You guys remember? Oh, one for one. There you go. Card was broken. Some polys. 
We'll just kind of keep going through here. This is a mystery box, you guys. You got to believe in the mystery box for it shall guide us. Crazy. This is basically a collection from a duelist who, what, hasn't probably played for Legendary Collection Joey eight years. So, pretty old collection. Didn't really use sleeves. Lots of traps here. And our last kind of cards from this box. Got some compulses in there. Some DNA surgeries. Interdimensional matter transporter. If you guys saw that one. Bottomless trap holes. Torrential tributes. We could definitely make a deck from this collection. I think that would be kind of fun. Um, let's see what's inside this box over here. So this might be... Yeah, so this is... They held on to their... They probably used the rule books and the play mats from the star decks that they had going on here. There you go. This is the Cyber Dragon Revolution star deck. I think that's where that super poly was maybe. I'm not too sure where that came from. Got some of the rule books here. And then it looks like we have Dueling Legends official handbook. What? This is really cool. Garrett. Hey, Garrett. <laughs> Actually, this is not, see, there's rare cards and there's classic stuff, but this is kind of cool to see. Yugi Moto, Grandpa. I've always wanted to be like Grandpa. <laughs> Have their own shop. Uh, Yami, nice. Some of the popular monsters. Yo, this is sweet, you guys. Dark Sage, Dark Magician. Got the Valkyrian and the Magna Warriors. Wow, so it's kind of like a, a guide to some of those, Exodia the Forbidden One. When all five pieces of Exodia are gathered, Exodia the Forbidden One emerges, emerges to obliterate its opponent instantly. In Yugi and Kaiba's first duel ever, Yugi summoned Exodia the Forbidden One to defeat Kaiba. Unfortunately, Yugi was never able to summon Exodia the Forbidden One again after Weevil threw Yugi's Exodia card into the ocean. Cards into the ocean. And then they, <laughs> when they sail to Duelist Kingdom. This is great. Basically, a whole bunch of forbidden memories. Wink, wink. You guys get it? Um, but yeah. Dark Magician Dark, Dark Paladin. Joey Wheeler and Joey Wheeler's popular cards. Oh, man, this art, you can just tell it's straight from the anime, too. This is good. Oh, you got My Valentine and Taya Garner. You got the cuties. Tristan, another cutie. <laughs> this is good. Mize Monsters. Oh, Bakura. Nice. The Amazon is Swordswoman there from mine. Bakura's, you got Dark Necrofear. Kaiba. There we go, Blue Eyes. Pegasus. Nice. Oh, there's Pegasus right there. This is this is unexpectedly kind of awesome, you guys. I'm not gonna lie. Shadi. Merrick. Merrick! Got Lava Golem there. And Ishizu. Oh, hey. Looks like Garrett completed the puzzle there many moons ago. That's awesome. All right, you guys, next we do have the Yu-Gi-Oh! 2006 Trainer's Guide here. I like how they did like the Pokemon thing with trainers. I feel like it should be Duelist Guide. Just want to say, marketing, come to Simple and Lucky and ask about how Yu-Gi-Oh! works. Um, Yu-Gi-Oh! Fun decks, top 50 cards, puzzles. You know what we could do? We could do a video with Yu-Gi-Oh!'s top 50 cards from 2006. <laughs> That'd be fun. Uh, but before we check that out, let's check out one more box. Let's do some cards and then some, some media. Okay, let's see you. Hey, that's not too long ago, Photon Shockwave. So it looks like Garrett bought some packs every now and then, but nice middle chase. Interplanetary Purply Thorny Dragon. Oh, hey, Lady in White, that's a good one. Jerry Beans, man, that's the best one. Jerry Beans, man, oh, we had him memorized. Oh, untapped power, right? Something like that. Jerry, a bean soldier, believes he's the strongest warrior in the world, but his true abilities are still untested. Okay, nice and Medolches and Zombies. That is a couple good decks there, Garrett. A couple good decks. We got Mizuki there, that's a good one. I like Mizuki. You know, we are seeing some MRD cards and LOB cards here and there, you guys. So I just want to say, there is still one yet, one box we have yet to open. I'm starting to believe a little bit here. I believe in the Simply Squad. Oh, that's a Grandmaster, Grandmaster. I believe in the Simply Squad for they have provided us with this amazing video. Ooh, Metal Zoe, did you guys see that? Interplanetary Purply Thorny Dragon. 
Uh, but yeah, there we go. Metal Zoa. All right, you guys. That is that. Let's go ahead and set that there. Oh, still got a little bit more cards here. I gotta believe. Man, this Interplanetary Perfect 20 track. Um, it hurts a little bit seeing so much damage. Um, I, I've played this game, you know, since the beginning. And since the beginning, I've really tried to keep my cards in good condition. So it, do, it does hurt a little bit to see this, but it is at the end of the day, the duelist choice. If they want to keep their cards in good, decent condition so they can, there we go, Zodius. Hey, a horse of Blackland, level eight, level four. Cool. It is the duelist choice at the end of the day. All right, you guys, here it is. The unofficial Yu-Gi-Oh! 2006. Unofficial. Trainer's guy. Just want to remind you guys it is unofficial. Uh, remember, there's fun decks, top 50 cards, and puzzles. I love sports sort of sparkle and puzzles uh, are inside here. And this is from uh, Editor-in-Chief Bill Gill, a.k.a. Pojo. Wow. This is, uh, this is the good stuff. Top 50 cards you should be playing. Pot of Greed. I like the Yugi pictures. Do you have these cards in your deck? Graceful Charity. So number one is Pot of Greed. Oh, they started with number one. Okay, that's a little anticlimactic, but you know. <laughs> Graceful Charity, Pot of Greed, two of the best cards in the game. I think we all know. I think we all know. Don't Link Duo, Sangan, Breaker, Heavy Storm. Wow. I'm liking that a lot. Black Luster Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning. Ring of Destruction, Sinister Serpent. Hold on, that's interesting. It's Monster Reborn Bandit this time. Mystical Space Typhoon, Snatch Steel, Mirror Force, Spear Reaper. This is pretty much a whole bunch of cards that got banned. This is great. Great seeing all this stuff. Blade Knight, that's my boy. We just uh, we just had a fun time with that guy. Jizno, the man's, that's a man's man right there, you guys. Man's man. It just knows a 22. That's my favorite number. Just want to let everybody know. So just know. Slate Warrior. I remember that guy. Berserk Gorilla. I played that deck back in the day. So it looks like this is up to FET, maybe. Is the newest set I'm seeing here. Book of Moon. Very powerful. Magic Terrain was good. Magic Cylinders. Injection Fairy Lily. That was in my Berserk Gorilla Earth Beatdown deck. Oh, number 42 is Morphing Jar. And last but not least, your card destruction. Card destruction you would play with your Dark Magician of Chaos in your deck. Ultimate Rare First Edition Mobius. It looks real good. Looks real good. Windstorm one, attack one. We'll slice up decks that rely on Scapegoat and Berserker real, real good. Nice metamorphosis. That card should have been way higher up there. Maybe Relinquish or Thousand Eyes was banned or something. How to talk like a pro, a Yu-Gi-Oh! CCG dictionary. Metagame describes the common themes and trends where you play. Spear Dragon's popular in the metagame right now, guys. <laughs> Top decking, side decking, main deck, sanctioned tournament. Sip on Lucky Game Shop, OTS, baby. Oh, here we go, OTK, one turn knockouts. I use Yadagarasa to get an OTK. FTK, first turn knockout. Drew Megamorph, Cyberstein, Raigeki, Harpy's Feather Duster, FTK. And then Yada Lock, Beat Stick. Hey, you guys have asked in my videos what I'm talking about when I say Beat Stick. Monster with 1800 or higher attack with four stars. For example, Kaiku and Berserk Gorilla. <laughs> Cookie Cutter deck. It's copied card for card from another player. Yep. It's good stuff. Oh, but here's some abbreviations. What? Change of Heart with COH. Never knew that one. TT for Torrential. BLOS, that's that's a good one. Abood. T, T Virus, <laughs> I heard that one. X Force. Gaff is Goblin Attack Force. Wow, that's actually some interesting stuff there. The Zoo Beast deck. Holy, I was just talking about this deck. This is the deck that I built, you guys. I actually was able to beat Chaos with it. It's a good time. Back in the day, you guys. Invasion of Chaos. Oh, yeah, there you go. Some duelists having some fun with their cards. Rawr. Your best friends, your rival. The dueling guy. There's the top 10 dragon type monsters. You guys were curious. Uh, Chaos Envoy the Ends at the front. It's not pretty good. Oh, looks like Garrett didn't do that puzzle. Looks like we got a puzzle to do later. Esperoba, my boy. He's in there. He's in the puzzle. Oh. 
Pretty cool. All right, Dueling Legends and the Trainer's Guide. The Box of Destiny. Here we go. I was wondering where all the rare cards were. All right, starting off, we got some rares. Summon Skull. Oh, whoa! Um, it's a Mago Negro, which is... I, feel, I think how oh, you guys will know, obviously, but um, I think it's not exactly Spanish. <laughs> I'm going to say Portuguese or... Um, yes. Nice. Some Japanese. Tokens. Force Raider, Curse of Dragon, Marshmallow, and Vampire Lords. Duty of Sigma, there you go. You Bells. Pete in the Dark Clown, Toon Mermaid. Man, this video is a blast from the past. That's at least definitely something's going on here. A lot of Elemental Heroes. Blade Edge. Venom and Naganon. <laughs> Dark Cheroid, DD Warrior, DD Crazy Beast. Hey, Mataz the Zapper. Always had fun with that guy. Zapping my opponents. Hey, no, 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 no. Nice. All right. This is it, you guys. Oh, some foils there, it looks like. Let's see if we can stay in the rare pile. Um, Blade Fly, Spirit of the Harp. Oh, man, Spirit of the Harp all the way from LOB. Little Camaro Harpy Queen. A lot of awesome cards here. Destiny Rose, there's a Relinquish. Flame Ghost, Camaro Attack Over Dragons. Cyber End Dragons. There's Wild Edge. Nice first edition uh, Duelist Pack 5 cards there. And let's see if I can keep it up with this side. Maybe we'll run into less foils over here. Alright, so we got Flare Neos. Aqua Neos. Awesome cards from Battle Pack 2. Oh, got some foils going on here. Let's see. All right, looks like those are spells and traps, and then we got some monsters over here. All right, you guys, let's check it out. Some prohibitions, first edition, LCYW. Crystal Abundance, Crystal Beast, Destiny Draws. Super, I was like, is it here? Super Poly. Wow, from Raw Yellow Mega Pack. Two Super Polys, that's gorgeous. Hero Flash. H.E. Heart, nice. Emergency Calls from Raw Yellow Mega Pack. Future Fusion, gosh, that card used to be so broken, guys. Golly gee. Ooh, Instant Fusion, there we go. Raw Yellow Mega Pack, oh baby. Look at that. Some Grave Keepers. Gladiator Beasts. I believe that's the highest rarity, first edition. Moving rough. Destiny Draw, nice. First edition Ultra Rare from Duelist Pack. Five, is it five? Yeah. Ooh. We got Swords for Concealing Light from Yugi's World. That's pretty sweet. Forbidden Lance. Oh, Dark World Dealings from Joey's World. Elegant Egotist. Yeah, some nice cards here. Drag Down to the Graves. Monster Born's Rare. Dark Calling Rare from Duels Pack 6. There you go. Second Coin Toss. Oh, Hand Destructions. Oh, boy. Oh, baby. Cool. Another Dark Calling. Revoke Fusion. Interesting. Nice, you guys. All right, let's see what's in the monsters here. Goblin Elite Attack Force. This is our Battle Pack 2 Shatter Foils, or whatever they called them at the time. I was going to say, is that Tour Guide? No, that's just... Oh, oh, okay. Duelist Pack Hyba Blue Eyes. This. Very nice. Okay, Meteor Dragon. Well, we've got to set aside Kaiba's Blue Eyes is there. Trihorn Dragon, Harpy's Lady. Oh, man. Sorcerer Dark Magic. Dark Magician Girl. Very cool. Maiden, Spear Dragon, nice Kaiku there. Got the Crystal Beast cards, LCYW, ooh, LOB Celtic Guardian, there you go. And the Spatians, there is a DD Crow. Super, there's a set of DD Crows from those foil packs. Chaos Sorcerer, there's the Nova, a hey, Hyper Librarian. Very cool. And it looks like we have one more stack of cards here. Schwinn Headed Thunder Dragon. That's awesome. Set that guy right there. Oh, 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 okay. Forbidden Legacy. We've seen a few of those, you guys. Very nice. We've got the Dark Magician. Another Dark Magician. A Blue Eyes White Dragon. Wow, Red Eyes from the Tin. A little damage, though. That's gorgeous. 
We got a bestiary. Poplimus. The quarry, the quarry. Oh, those look really nice. Some Necrogardenus. Another Lepari. Oh, Cyber Dragons from the Raw Yellow Mega Pack. Hey, you got the, uh, what's her name? Well, it's Matt, obviously, but I'm thinking the Japanese one. Dark and Dragon, Master Deanne. Shining. A couple fake cards here. Got the Dark Witch, Harpy's Pet Dragon. Very nice, you guys. Epic box there. Superconductor Tyranno. Six M Rise. Oh, baby. Ultra Rare. All from Raw Yellow Mega Pack as well. Just a few more cards. A morphing Jar. Nice. Hey, SYU. So, uh, Yu Gi Evolution. First edition. Blackluster Soldier. Malicious Fiend from Duels Pack 6. First edition. UFO Fighter. There you go. <laughs> Black Skull Dragon. And nice Blue Eyes Ultimate and Dragon Master Knight. Awesome. That was a pretty epic collection in that. Just a whole bunch of classic cards, but also, you guys, a Yu Gi No No, or sorry, Yu Gi Oh! unofficial guide along with the official dueling handbook. All right, you guys, so this was a massive mystery box that Garrett sent over. Thanks again for sending that over. And again, if you guys want to send your own mystery box, all you guys have to do is contact us at SimpleSquadSQ at Gmail, and we'll figure out how to get that over here. And I will be totally unaware of what's inside for a video. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the content. And super unlucky, signing out.